Welcome back to our channel. Today, we are diving into an intense military showdown, can the Russian S-400 air defense system shoot down China's stealthy J-20 fighter jet? This is a question that sparks debate among defense analysts worldwide. Let's break it down. The S-400's capabilities. The S-400 Triumph is one of the most advanced air defense systems in the world. Developed by Russia, it is designed to detect, track, and destroy aerial threats, including aircraft, drones, cruise missiles, and even stealth fighters. With a detection range of up to 600 kilometers and a missile engagement range of 400 kilometers, the S-400 is equipped with multiple radar systems, including the 91N6E Big Bird and 92N6E Gravestone, which operate across different frequencies. This helps it counter stealth technology by detecting low observable aircraft like the J-20 from multiple angles. The system uses for different missile types, 40N6, 48N6, 9M96E2, and 9M96E. The 40N6 missile, in particular, has an active radar seeker, allowing it to track and engage targets beyond 380 kilometers with precision. The J-20 Stealth and Evasion China's Chengdu J-20, also known as the Mighty Dragon, is a fifth-generation stealth fighter designed for air superiority and deep penetration strikes. It uses stealth coating, a low radar cross-section, RCS, and advanced electronic warfare, EW, systems to evade detection. The JR-20 also features supercruise capability, which allows it to fly at supersonic speeds without afterburners, reducing its infrared signature. One of its key defenses against systems like the S-400 is electronic countermeasures, ECM, which can jam enemy radars. Additionally, the J-20 is designed to use terrain masking and high-speed maneuvers to evade missile locks. S-400 vs. J-20, who wins? The answer depends on several factors. 1. Detection range. While the S-400's radar can detect stealth aircraft, the J-20's RCS is significantly lower than conventional jets, making detection difficult. 2. Electronic warfare. If the J-20 can successfully jam the S-400's radars, it might avoid detection or disrupt missile guidance. 3. Engagement strategy. The S-400 is most effective when integrated into a multi-layered defense system with early warning aircraft and networked radars. If operated alone, its effectiveness against stealth aircraft is reduced. 4. Pilot tactics. The J-20 can exploit weaknesses in the S-400 by using low-altitude penetration or attacking from unexpected angles. Final verdict. The S-400 has a strong chance of detecting and engaging the J-20, especially if supported by additional radar networks. However, the J-20 stealth and electronic warfare capabilities could make it difficult to achieve a successful kill. In a real-world scenario, the outcome would depend on who has better tactics, support systems, and situational awareness. What do you think? Can the S-400 take down the J-20, or will stealth and technology triumph? Let us know in the comments. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe for more military tech analysis. See you in the next video.